You're never gonna make it, you're not good enough There's a million other people with the same stuff You really think you're different, man, you must be kidding Think you're gonna hit it, but you just don't get it It's impossible, it's not probable, you're irresponsible Too many obstacles, you gotta stop it, yo You gotta take it slow, you can't be a pro Don't waste your time no more Who the fuck are you to tell me what to do? I don't give a damn if you say you disapprove I'm gonna make my move, I'm gonna make it soon And I'll do it cause it's what I wanna fucking do Cause all these opinions and all these positions They come in in millions, they block in your vision But no, you can't listen, that shit is all fiction Cause you hold the power you're as long as you're trying make it there's no way that you make it And maybe you can fake it But you're never gonna make it Aren't you just gonna take that? Make them take it all back Don't tell me you believe that Aren't you just gonna take that? Or will you fucking fight back? Fight back. Yo guys and welcome to the FGGVO Mortal Kombat 11 tournament. I'm your host Silent One. Let's kick things off right. So first matchup of the tournament will be, after randomizing, it will be me versus Classic Malt. Shit. <laughs> Well, <laughs> that, per that percentage chance of winning, I think I can do it. Yeah. Yeah. I think I can. All right. Let's, uh, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Geller Mill, thanks for the follow. Chubby Chubbs Malone, thanks for the follow. see how things go down for the first match of the tournament. Oh man, it's not looking too good for me. Not looking too good, but we'll see how things turn out. I don't know. MK versus DC was the last good Mortal Kombat. Mm. I don't know about that, man. I don't know about that. Sector was a better grandmaster. He led through lies and fear. They are the pillars of order. Honestly, uh, MK9 was really fucking good. Oof. Just round one. Now uh, let's see. Let's see how round two goes. Oof. Motherfucker. 
Oof. Damn. It's official. You suck. Oh, I'm dead as fuck. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah, man. Thought the tourney was tomorrow? No, 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 no. Yeah, first of two. Yeah. Sorry, I know you MKG guys are used to doing uh, Saturday tournaments and stuff like that, but yeah. I always... Uh, I always do Friday tournaments. First the two don't mean shit. Alright, what means something? What means something, Chubbs? I need I need to hear your per wise perspective on what counts. Whoa. Oh fuck, I didn't realize it got bad! Damn. Oof. One smash? Pfft, I ain't got smash. The fuck this is Oh god damn that fucking hurt. Alright, let's go. Oof. Damn. Did me dirty. Motherfucker. First match, classic Vault will take it. Good games, man. Next up is Giller Me versus Poop Feast. Alright, there's Giller Me and there's Poop Feast. Alright. Force Combat. Giller Me. Oh shit. Hold on. How do I go AFK? Ah. Uh, there we go. All right, let's see. Sonya versus Kano incoming. Oh man, here we go. 
Alright. Change this up real quick. Poop feast for twenty. Alright, here we go. Let's see how things go now. Incompetent tourney staff. Eh, it'd be like that. I haven't played MK since last year, honestly. Ever since that last MK tournament I held. Oh man, I ain't gonna lie to you. Have not played. Okay, I tell a lie. I played a little last month when I was setting up the MK tournament for this month. Because I had to reinstall and all this other bullshit. Have a go then, Sonya. Say goodbye to the other half of your face. Round one. Fight. You either? Perfect. Oof. Nice play to blow right at the start. Good shit. Definitely doing a lot of good zoning right now from Gillert. Alright. Poop Fest is in with Kano. Good stuff. Trying to get that damage. Ooh. Gillert's doing really well right now. Good stuff. Trying to get him in the corner. Good use of meter burn right there. Alright. Good blocks. Hell yeah. Ooh. Alright, here we go. Poop opened him up. Ooh. Nice use of recovery. There you go. Round Geller. Good stuff. Alright, good meter burn right there. Alright, good stuff. Nice opener. Gotta be careful. Alright, good grab. Alright, good stuff right there. Poop Faced is definitely having a bit of a trouble right now. I'm trying to get in. Alright, there you go. He's in. Good stuff. Keep the momentum up. Ooh, damn. Alright, recovered. There you go. Ooh. Got knocked right the hell out of the Fatal Blow. Good stuff. Alright. And that's it. A quick first match from Gullert. Hey Lane, how's it going? We have a trained ape playing Sonya in here. <laughs> hey, I mean, it's just how it works, man. Tater. Oh, yeah, that's right. It switched sides. Sonya. Whoop. Bushi Dragon Grotto. There we go. Bam, bam, we are done. But Taco, it is crossplay with Xbox. Round one, fight. Yeah. That's why the tournament says international, and on the challenge page, it even says crossplay. So yeah, man. Uh, <laughs> you missed out. Maybe next time. Yeah, Lane, for real. It has crossplay with PS4 and Xbox One. God bless Poop Feast. Honestly, it's really it's really dirty, honestly. <laughs> Jesus, man. Zone game is something else right now. Ah, oh, beautiful. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Hit them lows, man. Poop piece is just like, nah, man. I'm out. Okay, good. Fine, doing something. Got him in the corner. Hell yeah. Alright. Good use of meter to get him off you. Alright, good throw. Good damage. Now time for zoning. 
Oof. Damn, man. And that'd be it. Guller takes it. Let's see. All right, so that'll be a quick one. Good luck uh, and losers, my man. Poop. All right, next match up is. All right, we're done with these guys. Is Squatch versus Classic. You win too. What's a cannon end to this fight? Sonya taking a gun and blasting Kano in the dome. It's first to two still. It isn't until we get to semifinals and up that it'll turn into first to three, since you don't know, small tournament and all. All right, so. Let's get this over with. Squatch. And classic. Awesome. Hey, Peachy, thanks for the follow. Let's see, what the hell? I didn't get the damn notification of the stream being live. Yes. It is live. Welcome, loud. Hope you guys are having a fun time. Yink. Ah, oh, man. It's fine. The intro is the same as always. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, since we have less than eight people, you know, eight or less people is always my cutoff, so it's like... If we have later as eight or less people, I stream every match. So, don't worry. If you have a losers match, just wait it out. We'll stream yours after we're done with the winner side. Also, sweet, get to see spawn in action. So this will be fun. Oh man. Ah, don't worry, Peachy, you'll be fine. By the way, how's Doom Eternal? I've been wanting to play it. Got no money. Give you a rundown on spawn? Okay. <clears throat> he embodies 90s edge and extreme stuff. So, that is spawn. In like the quickest nutshell. He's got hell powers and guns and chains and shit. His cape can transform. Just peak fucking 90s shit. Alright. I'm all doing a lot of good work right now with Spawn. Squatch having a difficult time with Jade at the moment. And there he goes. Round one. Hey, Lethal. And yeah, basically, he's based. Alright, there you go. Playing a mean zone game right now. Oof, man. Good anti-air, though. Alright, there you go. He's got him in the corner. Mm. Beautiful. Ooh, messed up his combo right there. Good uppercut. Alright, now he's in the corner. 
Oof. Big damage. Good combo. Nice. Alright, there you go. Squatch ain't out yet. There you go. Throw a little bit of fireball game right here. And. Ooh. Boot to the head. And a mercy. Let's see if. Uh, let's see if Classic won't live to regret it. Ooh. Nice. Good fatal blow. Damn, man. Alright, there you go. Ooh, nice. Knocked him out of his fatal blow. Good stuff. But, that's it. Mm. And sitting upon his throne, Classic takes the first match. Spawn wins. You got two pints of fries? The fuck? God damn, man. I would love some fries. Right? I also love the fact that he makes a reference to being in Soul Calibur as well. But my soul still burns. Uh, good stuff. Good stuff. Alright, let me swatch the names. Swap the names real quick. No, honestly, his brutalities are fucking perfect. Yeah. He really does. He really does. It's super funny, honestly. I always find it funny as fuck when you do stuff like Fatal Blows or whatever on a character and they have to do the zoom in and stuff. It's like if a character's got a mask, they take off, they like x ray the mask. Like, they just want you to really get into the nitty gritty of it, you know? I mean, yeah, he does look like just a naked dude wearing a, a leather fetish bodysuit. Go back to the one you came from. Not till I'm good and ready. Also, his voice. Can we just say, mm. perfect casting? Perfect fucking casting, man. Just such a good voice. Oof. Couldn't do the rush, got a little punish there. Ooh, alright, what a trait. No anti -air. No, I'm a little too far for that. Alright, punish on the rush. Oh, wow, damn. How plus is he on that rush? Alright, there you go. Ooh, good punch right there. Nice fireball game. Getting in with the chains. And, alright, good. Good stuff right there. Squatch ain't out yet. Good anti-air. Ooh, damn, man. Coming down hard. All right, there you go. And the fatal blow. Here you go. 90s as fuck, man. Look at this guy. Guns and then hell powers. Like, God bless. And, uh, yeah, it is Keith David. It's great, honestly. Guns on capes. Guns in the cape lane. Guns in the cape. Guns in the cape summons hell spawns to rip you in half. And then comes down with chains. Yeah, exactly. Guns, hell powers, then chains. Easy. The shit I drew on napkin dirt elementary school. I mean, literally, that's just spawn. He represents the 90s, man. The hardcore, edgy 90s. Alright, Mercy. Squash is just here like, come on, man. Come on. Just fucking do it. Oof! God damn. <laughs> God damn. No, honestly, Spawn was done really fucking well. Like, they got spawned down pat. Did he die? He ain't, he ain't alive. I'll tell you that right fucking now for free. He ain't alive. <laughs> like, yeah. He ain't doing so good. Alright, so...
Malt will move on. And next up is... God damn, move out the way. Peachy and Guller. So, let me get these two... Let me get these two boys in here. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Let's go. Lower bracket. Losers bracket, son. Losers. Why? Because you lost. You're a loser. It's just how it is. Get to see Collector doing some stuff. Nice, nice. I actually don't remember anyone using Collector in the in the first tournament, so I'm guessing guessing a lot of people warmed up to Collector after the time passed. We'll see who's the loser. Chubbs, my son. I'm already in loser's bracket. You can't tell me anything. <laughs> I'm not expecting to do well. Ooh! God damn, man. Uh, I'm not expecting to do well. Yeah, I've been hearing this whole thing about a Swedish guy killed MKG. Anyone want to give me the lore on that? Because I am mad lost. Like, I don't mind the MKG guys being an FGG, honestly. I really don't. I just want to know what the actual fuck happened. Woof. Alright, so Guller took it. Okay, Finland. Whatever. What the fuck actually happened? Cape shit DLC made us lose the interest. Really? Damn man, but spawn is fun though. Oh, do you mean Joker though? I totally forgot Joker's the thing. Yeah, actually, I totally forgot Joker was in this game. Alright, here we go. Good stuff right there. From Peachy. Alright. Life was bail. And, damn. Nope, never mind. Let's see. We lost interest because Spawn ki because Sean kills the lore fans in a single blow. Nah, Finn played the game as one of the best players we had. Lore fans were murdered. Oh, is it because fucking God? I thought they were. I thought they were already fucking killed off on the fact that. Joker references MK versus DC, whereas wasn't MK versus DC taking place in the original timeline and not the rebooted timeline from MK9? Thus, people remembering MK versus DC even happening doesn't make sense whatsoever. So, you know. Oh, the score is 1 0 right now. There we go. Yeah, I've heard... I've heard so many people just be upset as fuck with 11 compared to 10. So, from your guys' perspective, what makes MK11 so bad? Cause I remember like enjoying MKX. 
But I know a lot of people fucking hate 11. Like, I know a lot of people said they already got bored of playing MK11, even while waiting for spawn and stuff. The roster's like, meh. And it's slowed down. Okay. Understandable. I remember MKX being a lot faster as well. MK11 is the most balanced NRS game out there. Well, I mean, it's like most people say, balance doesn't equal fun. So, you know, I guess that's where we're at now, huh? When it comes to MK11. Because, like, if balance meant fun, then fucking Marvel 2 wouldn't have been played for 10 fucking years. Because that game was an unbalanced piece of shit. But it was a fun unbalanced piece of shit. Alright, damn. Looks like Peachy's actually making some work headway right now. Oh, shit. And there you go. Guller managed to get into the fatal blow. Alright. Life's evened up a bit. Ooh, shit. <laughs> nice. Good trade. Good trade right there. Alright, Peachy. You, you're doing alright. You're doing good right there. Do it one more time. We'll be evened up. Oof. Hell yeah. See, he just need to, need to work off that rust, man. He just need to work that off a little bit. Just like, okay, okay. No, yeah, honestly, that was honestly a cool interaction. <laughs> With the whole bola and everything, that, that was super nice. But yeah, honestly, the thing that kind of has me, like, thinking, it's like, oh man, if MK11 was, like, this polarizing, I can only imagine how Injustice 3 will be when it comes to, you know, uh, audience retention and stuff like that. Ooh, man, Peachy just putting in the work right now, not letting Geller have a single moment of rest. Ooh, use those bolas. Hell yeah, just waiting for projectiles. Blocking, good stuff. Uh-oh. All right, grab opened him up. What's the mix-up? Okay, backdash. Oh, shit. Hit him right out of his fatal blow. All right, good shit right there with the chip, and... Hmm, hold on. Out of here. Alright, Peachy. Uh, first 1-1 one, one of the tournament. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Like the M like the fucking DLC cycle was just like so long. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that that's understandable. Cause like half of it is just like, oh hell yeah, this character's back, and then the other one's like, why is this fucking character here? Yeah, that's understandable. It's super understandable, honestly. I, I can, I can see where a lot of people would just be tired out, especially if, like, the meta game and just seeing a lot of the same characters often enough, where it just gets really boring. Every month, a few uh, new character would be perfect cycle, and then a two month pause, and then a uh, combat pack two trailer. The truth is, we're both collectors. Many would call us parasites. Honestly, okay. I don't think making spawn the last character was a bad move because it feels like they really wanted Spawn to be done right, you know what I mean? So he needed the most attention when it came to character DLC and creation. So honestly, it sucks that the coolest character was last, but you know, it's better this way because he came out so fucking like well-crafted. So yeah, it's like, I get it, trust me. 
But also, if you think about it, having a character come out every month... Round two. I'll say this. It's like, I get the idea of wanting characters to come out every month, because waiting two months for each character is a slog. I get it. But I will say this. If the only interest you have in the game is waiting for new thing to come out, play it for a bit, and then you get tired of the new thing, and just wait for the next new thing, are you actually enjoying it, or are you playing it kind of like out of obligation, or just like, oh, you know, maybe, maybe the next character will be my thing to keep me playing, or, oh, don't worry, this time for real, like, it's got my attention. Yeah. Like that, you know what I mean? It's like, I get it, trust me. Because here's the thing, I play a lot of games, I play... I play too many fucking fighters. That's my problem. I play too many of them. And I will say this. I play a lot of them where they don't get the chance of stuff like Mortal Kombat 11 or Street Fighter or anything like that. Where they're they're allowed to have, you know, new characters coming out every now and then. It's like, the character list is done. They don't get characters for, like, anything. You know, so it's just how it is. But yeah, it's literally set point for both of them right now. They're doing really good. Oof. Here we go. Got him in the corner. Hell yeah, with the bolas, baby. Oof. Alright, what's the next? Ooh, waited for it. Knew something was happening. Got a looking pretty deficit right now. Ooh, damn, man. Peachy putting that work. Damn, here we go. Ooh, gotta be careful with the wake ups. Alright, nice sweep. Good block. Ooh, shit. Big punch right there into the fatal blow. Mmm. Alright, there we go. There you go. Teleport behind you, fatal blow, and Peachy is taking this, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there you go guys peachy took it with the clutch look at those shekels <laughs> Oh that that was beautiful You got greedy guller you got greedy All right, so Good stuff, man. We'll see your match in losers in a bit. But for now, it'll be Classic Malt versus Peachy. Also, um, you guys can hear me and stuff just saying this will be first to three. Oh yeah, Peachy, uh, step out of the King of the Hill. That way I can throw you this invite. Uh, no. I mean, I'm doing the winner side. Yep. Literally finishing off winner side right now. Let's see. Let's see. Gear me has they them pronouns, so fix it. No, no, uh, gear, you don't have to play right now. We're doing uh, the semifinals between class uh, malt and peachy. Gears. And then after that, we start doing Collect. we start doing uh, losers matches. Black 
There we go. Reset the scores. And this will be first to three, gentlemen. So let's see how this goes. Yeah. I'm guessing you guys, as soon as you get to the stuff like semifinals, you guys just wait it out. They are well guarded, collector. Not my hands. Round one. Alright, so let's see. Dark side looking ass. Let's see how this goes. Alright, so he's chucking some plasma right now. Good stuff. Ooh shit. Ooh. Fuck, man. That chunk of health. God damn, man. Alright. Peach ain't out yet. Alright. Good stuff right there. Trying to burn him a bit. Alright. There you go. Good stuff. Nice grab. Man. I'll say right now, I love me a good grab. That just does like some nice chunky damage, man. Cause it's like hell yeah, man. That was good reason to get up close on you. And mm, god damn. Ooh, man, just try to do the wake up fatal blow on this man. And there you go. All right, good stuff on Peachy. He'll take the first round. Oh, who do I play? Uh. Sub-Zero, because I'm a basic bitch like that. <laughs> By the way, how you, how you doing, Easter Blue? How's it going, man? Oof. Damn. Very good start right there from Peachy. Nice. Set up. Oof. Walk up grab. Bam. Alright, good stuff right there. Peachy definitely trying to mind his spacing right now. Good uppercut. Alright, here we go. Getting in there with Garrus. Ooh. There you go. Good chunky throw. Get him away from you. Alright, trying to do the meter burn bol bolus. Alright. Being careful here. Damn, chunky grab. Dunk this fool. Ooh. Try doing roll on wake up. And there's the fatal blow. Alright, so Malt will take this round. Yep, that'd be it. Robbed. I mean... <laughs> robbery, is it just happens, man. Fatal blows are robbery. They're basically just, you know... They're literally just the ultras of MK11, and it's super funny as hell. Ooh, man. But that was that was super nice, though, from Peachy. All right, good duck and a supper cut, and that'll be it. Mm. Nice. All right, Peachy, uh, Peachy doing it big right now. Honestly, Peachy, Peachy, whew. Honestly, yeah, Peachy's doing it really good right now with Collector. So, let's see, is Malt gonna swap characters? Maybe just dump Garrus and go for a little something else? Maybe go with Spawn? You know, maybe people are still aren't used to Spawn yet. Oh, Baraka time? Collector. Okay, it's time for Baraka. Nah, nah, he's not running the con just yet. So we'll see. Let's see how things go from here. Ah, oh, 
God damn, man. I can see you're jealous. I should command Shao Kahn's armies. First, prove yourself in combat. Alright, here we go, guys. Let's see how things turn out this time. Ooh, alright. Nice pokes. Good stuff right there. Nice fireball game. Alright, there we go. Checking to plasma. Waiting for it. Ooh. Alright, there you go. Nice use of bolas. Here we go. Get some nice chunky damage and some wall carry. Throw out some plasma. Ooh. Nice roll. Got punished a little bit though. And there you go. Slice, 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 slice. Ooh, try to grab on his wake up. See what happens. And alright. There you go. Just drop a little fireball right there for some burn. Let him burn himself a little bit right there while still waiting. Get hit with the fireballs. Alright, he's backing up into the corner right now. Good use of collector's ball and chain right there. Alright, there you go. Perfect. Just chuck right there a little bit. Ooh. Okay. Peachy looking a little bit low on the life deficit right now. And... Okay, roll. Almost had the full punish right there. And there it is. Alright. Round one goes to the classic. Round two. Fight. Ooh, here we go. Alright, crouching. And here you go. Ah, there you go. Nice use of the interactions right there. Alright, waiting for it. Waiting opportunity. He's probably trying to anti her there. Got knocked. There you go. Just eyeballing each other. Alright. Good use. Trying to use the EX, trying to use the meter burn of the bolos right there. There you go. Good grab right into the corner. What's gonna happen? Ooh, got punched right into it. Alright, good breakaway. Ooh, not looking so good right now. And that's it. All right, so, mm. Over 90% of interactables are used when trying to amplify a move. Are they now? Huh. All right, that's a good thing to know. All right, so, they're 1-1 one, one now. Does Peachy have another character? Make an adjustment. Really? Really, we're do we're doing this. All right. <laughs> They're tied one one. Challenge me for the tribe. By the rules of the Katkarakatan, I shall feast on your flesh. Round one. Fight. Yeah, time for the mirror match. Let's see how things work out for Peachy. Alright, there you go. Setting up the flag. Alright. Fireball game right now. Good stuff. Ooh, tried neutral jumping and getting a punish, but just got punished instead. Ooh, good use of meter burn. Nice juggle afterwards. Ah, oh, damn. There goes a big chunk right there of Peachy's health. Oh, I tried anti-airing and just the wake up fatal blow. Just to get some damage on board right now. Oof, gotta be careful. And there it is. Let's see. Round two. Uh, right now, it's looking like Malt is uh, kind of holding it up right now. And, dude, look, don't expect too much from Warner Brothers. They're just a small indie company. Like, you can't expect passwords from them, okay? Ooh, man, that was a nice punish right there. Alright, in the corner. Alright, good throw. Trying to get in there. 
Mm. Jesus, man. Health just melted away right there. Oh, man. Unless Pichu can do something big right now, he's not going to be able to make it. And there it is. No, honestly, the damage was fucking ridiculous. Alright, but, you know, if Malt takes this next match, it's over, and then Peachy gets knocked down to losers. Peachy needs to calm down and do what he was doing earlier, and just like, you know. I took a round. I'm good with that. Dude, you took, you took a match. You took a match. Don't put yourself down, man. Oh, we're going to see some Liu Kang action? Oh, shit. Fire God Liu Kang. No? Okay. Damn, who's he picking, though? Spin. Okay. This is first of three. Cyber Lin Kuei Assembly. Yep. If Classic takes this, we move on to loser's bracket. Nice. Fucking violator on the pike right there. It's fucking amazing. Round one. Fight. Oh man, I would have loved it if he just stayed there on the match, but there you go. That's what you need. That's what you needed, Peachy. You needed guns. Lots of guns. Alright, there you go. Ooh, tried to meet a burn, do a continuation off of that, see if anything would happen, but no, got fucking stuff. All right, there you go, getting pushed in. Fireball game. Oh man, let's see. What's he got? Nice jump in with the cape. Ooh, gonna continue the juggle afterwards. Ooh, nice chunky grab right there. Clocks has got him on the ropes. He's panicking pretty hard right now, and he fell to the grab. Yep. All right, here we go. Classic is on set point right now. Round. So we'll see what happens. Hey man, intros are nice. There's a lot of nice, you know, good work put into the intros, especially, you know, when there's a lot of different intros that can happen. And I do mean visually. Cause that uh violator intro, hey that was cool, I've never seen that before. Alright, good stuff right there, nice use of guns. Oof, gotta be careful here. Nice, good grab. Get him away from your ass. Trying to do some neutral jump stuff right there. Alright, Fatal Blow is ready to go. And he tried a Fatal Blow and got his Fatal Blow bleeding out. Alright, good stuff. Malt will move on. Yeah, Terminator's in this game. Oh, here we go. We're not just ending it. No, no, no. He wanted to really dump on him right there. Had to use it. No babality, no animality, no friendship. I mean, he's got the green blood. What, what do you want from Spawn? He's a green-blooded man. Alright, so, let's move on to losers. So, first losers match will be me versus Guller. So, let's, uh, let's do this, man.
By the way, this is first to two. Give me a second to uh, crank out the names. Reset the score. Special Forces Desert Command. There we go. Now Sam's taking a big old beating right now from Geller. Will he even get the chance or will it be a flawless victory, guys? Oof. Okay. It wasn't flawless. Amazing. looking too good and mercy beautiful all right there we go Damn, bro, you should have let your pet join. I would have loved to have seen that. Hand over Cyrax's body, Sub Zero. The special forces can restore him. My orders are to destroy all cybers. All right, let's see, let's see how this goes. Interesting trade. Oof. All right, here we go. Round two. Five. All right, peace, Koyo. Have a good time, man. Hope the rest of your day goes well. Better than this. Looks like that's it. And it is not it. Okay. Now it is it. Squatch left the room. Squatch forfeits. Damn. All right, well, uh, bad games? No, it was good games. It was good games, honestly. Good games, Geller. I mean, obviously not from me, but good games. All right, so let's see. Geller, 2-0. All right, so Squatch left. So Poop gets the buy. So, Poop and Guller, go. Okay. 
King in the hill. Forced. Bam. Let's see. Just play a gif of Sonya shooting instead of the match. Fair enough. Alright, so. Let's see. Let's uh, rewrite that. Let's take that a step back. Squatch, poop, let's go. Yeah, Squatch is back. It seems that he accidentally disconnected. So, you know, it happens. It happens to the best of us. Sometimes you're there on YouTube one minute. Next moment, you hit the shutdown button on your PS4. It happens. It happens. You know. Squatch. There we go. Let's see, I'm seeding 500 torrents on my Wi-Fi. Is that an issue? I mean, is it an issue for you? It's not an issue for me. I'm, I'm streaming just fine. I don't care about your, I don't care about your torrents. I mean, unless you're playing, then it's a problem. It's a problem for me. Keep the black Jesus Christ, man, you weren't kidding. Actual two pints of fries. Jesus. Jesus. Jesus Christ, Jeff. Alright, so, let's get into the actual match. Squatch trying to do stuff right here. And also, uh, no problem, man. I'm just glad that you guys are having fun with the tournament. You know, if MK11 still has, you know, is still alive decently enough after April, then hey, you know, another tournament will be definitely needed. That's for sure. I don't mind hosting another one after that time. Oof. Poop Beast just like dumping on him in the corner right now. Alright, there you go. Oh, okay. I got a question for you guys. Um, how's Nightwolf? I'm glad I got invited for this tournament. Nightwolf is S tier. The fuck? Also, damn, man. Flawless victory. Not even gonna give him the chance. Just be like, dude, come on, just end it. Haunt. Woof! Rip out the whole skelly. Goofy shit. I love it. Nightwolf is good? I see. I love hearing stuff like that. Because Nightwolf is one of the DLC characters I'm actually interested in. Yeah, exactly. The whole skelly. It's like, dude, come on, man. You can't take this shit fucking seriously with that kind of shit. It's like, come on, man. Rip out the whole skelly. Thank you. I needed that bone pun. Just go for him. Yeah, the third variation is nice. You can have my night wolf. What do you mean have your night wolf? The fuck? Let's see. That's the best to be on. Yeah, exactly. It's like when MK is being goofy over the top shit, it's like, yes. Exactly. Goofy violence is way too, it's like over it's like when you go so over the top it just becomes goofy shit. It's like, okay, now now you've got my interest. 
But when you try and take it too seriously, it's like, ah, oh, man, come on, man. We're just trying to have a goofy fucking time here. That's why it's like the story. It's like, especially with MK11, like, goddamn, man. Like, it took itself too fucking seriously with this whole time travel bullshit and resetting the universe again. Ooh, good stuff right there. Just watching out of this yet. Got that life lead. Can he maintain it? All right, good throw. Good. Get him in the corner. Trying to do some neutral jump setup right there. Gotta watch out for that double headbutt. All right, good grab. Nice. A little bit of health left. Ooh, kind of caught him himself in going down, but nice. See, honestly, brutalities I think are fun. Brutalities I think are fun because it's like you gotta work for them. Kind of like the old uh, fatalities back in the day where it's like, okay, you know, I just gotta work, I just gotta figure out how to do it and, and you know, the timing of the buttons and all that shit way back in the day. You need the right stuff. Now it's like, oh, just go into training mode and just hash that shit out. Brutality, it's like, okay, it's in the heat of the moment. You gotta keep track of shit, and it's like, okay, let me keep it in mind, and then bam, okay, got it. And it looks super fucking sick and goofy and all that nice stuff. No, it's like, the problem with a lot of fatalities, and honestly, I think it's the problem with fatal blows too, they're overly long. Like, they're trying to be like too overly dramatic and long where it just becomes like okay yeah they're they're dead they're fine because like after a point it's like it's a fatality it's like okay usually when they do the first hit of the fatality it's like dude they're fucking dead man No, yeah, that's also a problem with Grand Blue and stuff like that. It's like, yeah, the supers are cool, but they're so fucking long, and you'll see them every match. You'll fucking see them every match. Shit, every fucking round you'll see a super. Oof. Alright. And that'll be it. Poop Feast, we'll move on. No, oh, yeah, Squatch did pretty good. Good stuff. All right, now it'll be now it'll be Poop versus Giller. Yes, now we get the salty run back for realsies. All right, so let's see. There we go. King of the Hill. Poop. Guller. Poopster, the MKG villain moves on. Whoop. There you go, guys. I mean, that's literally his fucking name, though, loud. Here, just so you can read it correctly. So Just delete all slots because your slot for the KO is already automatically given. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I wasn't too sure about it. All right, I'll make sure to do that. That way, nobody just randomly jumps in. Especially now that we have, you know, random dude jump in.
But yeah. I'll see about eventually trying out stuff like Nightwolf and stuff because he looks interesting to me. I think he just looks fun and neat. And I played him a little bit in MK3 back then. So, you know, just, just a little memories. Yeah. I mean, he could have been bad for all I care. I just wanted to see, like, you know, if he was fun. That's, like, the thing I'm more interested in. It's like, oh, is he fun? Round two, fight. Combat Pack 2, ready for Deadpool. Oh, my God. Deadpool in this fucking game, man. Now, that, that would be fucking goofy shit. Honestly, I would only be able to handle it if they got Nolan North back as Deadpool's voice actor. Because that dude, oh man, that dude was Deadpool. He is Marvel. He is Marvel. I mean, doesn't mean that you can't have him. You know, money talks, as they say. Ooh, got hit right out of the fatal blow. Alright, one round apiece. Good start right here. Oh, the stage Deadpool. Oh, okay, okay. Oof, god damn, man, that headbutt. Here we go. Good stuff right here. Nice. Good throw. Alright, what's the setup? Oh, saw the roll coming. Damn, man. Ooh, made sure to meter burn for the kill too. And here we go. Ooh. Alright, so Giller will take the first one. Take no prisoners. We do have a Deadpool skin for spawn though. I mean, yeah, yeah, there is a Deadpool skin for him. It was pretty fun. Hey, Fear. I wish that was me. Jesus, man. Hey, man. Tournaments get wild. Some people perform well. Some just do not handle tournament times at all. Play a real character. Let's see me. I'm playing Jade. Nah, oh, dude. It's no problem, man. I'm just glad you guys are having fun. That's the important part here. Shang Tsung's Island Ruins. Ugh. As long as you guys are having fun with these tournaments, that's all that matters, honestly. So, Chubbs, who should I play? What's the what's a real character I should play? All right, so let's see how Poop's Jade handles out. Oof! God damn, man. Just getting, just getting dropped on hard. Try and play a decent zone game against Sonya right now. It's just not working out too well for Poop. All right, good roll. Nice throw. Good stuff. Ooh, try to catch him landing. Use the meter burn to stay up in the air a little longer. That was some good stuff. Nice drop with the prop. Ooh, gotta be careful here. Ooh, there you go. Pop! Good stuff with the throw. Fatal blow. Ooh, okay. Nice use of dashing. Getting in there with the grab. Nice. Ah, the glow doesn't work on the drones. Okay. Because I was wondering, it's like, okay, I know the glow is supposed to be like the anti projectile thing. But I was like, wait, why doesn't it happen? I was like, okay, that's funny. Actually, fear? It is. The tournament's crossplay. It's just not crossplay with PC. It's literally right now PS4 and Xbox One. Ooh. 
It's like this. The body that gave Shiva is a fine body. Her face is just gonna happen what happens to every character who's a story-centric character, but once they become playable, they get changed physically. Example I can give off the top of my head. Um, Colleen in Street Fighter V. Look at her face when she was in story mode. Look at her face when she became playable. Final Night and fucking day. Fight. Let's see, you can't have a uh, King of the Hills, so crossplay matches would be have to be played off stream. Yeah, that's the thing, Fear. It's not on. <laughs> it's crossplay, but it's like, oh, PC, huh? Mm. Damn. That's the one that got shafted for crossplay. What am I saying about Colleen's face? That if you look at her story mode design, like her face and all that stuff, and then look at her actual finish design when she became playable, it's massively different. Holy shit, did it actually just disconnect? <laughs> he disconnected. He was like, nah, fuck this. Poop left. Poop fucking left, man. Yep. <laughs> Poop left. He was not seen through that shit. He fucking disconnected. <laughs> Oh my god, that that was fucking great. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so Guller moves on. Poop got flushed. So next match will be Peachy versus Guller. Alright, so let's uh let's get that going. There we go. Also, this is first to three. From now until the tournament ends, it's all first to three. There we go. Let's see. Whoop. All right. Just to make sure I got the name set up. There we go. Reset the scores. Oh, man. Ah, oh, hell yeah. All right, so let's see. Scarlet. Oh, going right to Scarlet, huh? All right. Collector. Tank garage bunker. All right. So let's see how this goes. Scarlet versus Collector. I mean, hell, Molina got fucking killed, but hey, you know, death doesn't mean fucking anything in Mortal Kombat. Like, at all. So I'm expecting Molina to show up in Combat Pack 2, straight up. What do you pay for blood? I take, I do not pay. A respectable notion, Scarlet. Round <sighs> 
Yeah, exactly. It's like, oh look, Sindel died a long time ago. Ah, dude, JK, she's back. Shao Kahn died. Time travel, my man! He's back! We know when Scarlet was hot? God, I do. I do. She's okay now. Like, she's not, like, super hot or anything. She's alright. Yeah, Scarlet looks alright. I mean, she's not hot, hot like she used to be. You know, but... She's alright. God, fucking... Let's see. Honestly, yeah. Cassie in MK11, though? No. She's... She's the real deal. Honest to God, cutie. MKX Cassie, though? <laughs> oh, God. Mm, nah, man. Cassie in 10 did not... Did not look good at all. But I just lo I, I love the fact that it's like, oh, they probably took the feedback from that. And then it's like when designing her in MK11, they're like, okay, she needs to actually look like a combination of, you know, young Sonya and Johnny Cage. Two people who are, you know, good looking. Instead of this ugly fucking thing that shit was. Final round. Final no, yeah. You know, she had a body, but it's like that face, though, was, you know, ugh. Yeah, exactly. Everything but her face, right? It also helps the fact that they got her a new voice actress, but hey, look. No disrespect to MKX, Cassie's voice actress, but MK11, Cassie voice actress, got that sass, that personality. You know, literally a fucking combo of Sonya and fucking <laughs> and fucking Johnny, you know? Like that good combo of it. Oof. And just as I say this... Oh, missed. There you go. Got him. No, oh, yeah, man. Peachy... <laughs> Peachy came back. PG came back pretty, pretty good right there. Whoop. Injustice 2, Tourney. I don't have Injustice 2. I legit do not have Injustice 2 at all. Collector. But hey, if you want attorney, wink, wink. Lost hive of the Kaitin. You know, uh, just uh, just pay the candy man his due. You know what I'm saying? Wink. It's like I tell people. It's like I can only do tournaments for games I own. So. It'd be like that. I can't own every game. I really can't. I ain't got money like that. You're already subbed. How much money do I need? Dude, honestly, I don't know, man. It'd just be like that. Oh, shit. The bolos. Ah, damn. Too slow to actually get anything with it. Honestly, yeah. God. It's like, even with... Everything they've tried with Jackie and goddamn have they tried stuff with Jackie. I Can't see people honestly liking Jackie outside of her being a strong character like personality wise and stuff like that. It's like You know, I just don't see people liking Jackie as a person
I don't know why she's the NRS fan favorite, Round though. Two, like, it's like, really, out of all the characters they made, you know, for the mini combatants, it's like, Jackie's their favorite? It's like, not Cassie? Because Cassie seems like they put a lot of thought into her, especially after fucking, you know, after X and stuff with 9 and stuff, it's like, oh, 11 and stuff, it's like, oh, they put a lot of thought into Cassie and stuff. It's like, oh, she would definitely be the favorite, or... Look, I can understand Liu Kang having fans, because, you know, Bruce Lee homage, you know, the whole... And all that good stuff. But yeah, Jackie just kind of takes up space, man. God, you know what I actually remember? I remember when MKX was showing off mostly just the new characters, only some old ones. They didn't show off Sonya. They didn't show off fucking Johnny. They showed off Cassie. They showed off Jackie. They didn't show Jax. They didn't show any of those fuckers. And people were like, oh shit, is it just going to be like a majority new cast and stuff like that? People were freaking the fuck out. And then NRS was basically like, oh, here's Sonya, here's Johnny, here's Jax. And people were like, but why do you have the old generation with the new generation when people are mostly just going to stick with playing with the older characters most of the time? Alright, so, Giller won that. Good shit, man. Taking it back. It's a lot of a lot of back and forth going on in these matches right now, I'll tell you that. For free. There we go. So, here's the thing. You say Liu Kang is the most blank and all that stuff. It's like, I get it. It's because he falls into a lot of the trappings that a lot of fighting game MCs fell into back in the day. Where they were basically just like stoic warrior character. But honestly, at least then, yeah, he's MK's Ryu and that's what it is. But much like Ryu and, you know, stuff like that, Liu Kang and Ryu at least do get a little bit of development. And they do have some characteristics outside of just being, like, the stoic warrior man. You know, because, like, okay, like Shaolin Monks. When you played that and you had Liu Kang and Kung Lao just, like, fucking around and doing some shit, it's like... When Liu Kang is around Kung Lao, and Kung Lao is the fucking, like, goofy motherfucker who's cocky as shit, and Liu Kang is his straight man, it's like, they actually work well off of each other. They work really well off of each other, and it's like, okay. It's like, yeah, you know, during the tournament settings, which is where we mostly just see Liu Kang and stuff, it's like, of course he's just gonna be, you know, stoic warrior, man, because he's in a fucking life-or-death tournament. It's a fucking Kumite, goddammit. But it's like, outside of the actual tournaments and shit, it's like, you know? Round two, fight. He's got some stuff, man. But, you know, Shaolin Monks 2 when? After MK Fire and Ice, you know? <laughs> when's, uh, when's that fucking thing coming out? But, you know. It's just, uh, it's just how things are. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. Uh, the match is going really well right now for Gully. Okay, honestly, you joke. But if the Special Forces game can at least be fun, it'd be nice because it's like, you know, people nowadays know how to make a fucking third person action game. So it's like, it wouldn't be that hard to make it. So it could at least be interesting, at the very least. And maybe at the very least, Jackin could get some personality out of this goddamn spin-off game. You know what I'm you know what I'm fucking saying, right guys? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Anyways, looking really close right now, one hit away. Ooh, and there it is from Gully.
It was honestly super fucking close right there at the end. Like, one good solid hit would have done it. Yeah. One more match for Gully, though. But, Peachy could turn this around. Okay, you say he can't cope with air glaives, but Poop tried doing that. That didn't really work out for Poop. So, you know, it almost worked for Poop, but it really did it. <laughs> he just started timing his fireballs a lot better. And that's literally what flushed poop, you know what I mean? Like, well, there you go. And that good self collector. Alright, he's in the corner now. Just don't panic, Peachy. Mm. Alright. We'll set back here. Alright. Trying to mix it up. Nice, nice. He got a little opening there. Got a little scared. Backed off. Nice teleport. Alright, little fireball. Little blood ball, actually. Ooh, gotta watch out for the tentacle. Good opening with the bolus. Here we go. Time to get some nice chunky damage. Oh, recovered himself. But that means if he can get him in one more thing. Ah, damn. Alright, here we go. He's still recovering the meter. So he's got a chance to mess with him a little bit right now. Alright, gotta watch out the tentacles. Good stuff right there. Nice throw. Alright, good throwing. Good teleport. Ooh, okay. Ooh, tried bursting on recovery, but got neutral jump punished. Here we go. Ooh, good meter burn. Nice follow up. Ooh, dropped this combo. And got knocked out with the fatal blow. And that'll be it. How's it gonna end it? There you go. Just sweep, end it. Gully moves on. Peachy, good stuff, man. Better luck next time, my man. But Gully will move on. Still, it was a good showing, Peachy. It was a good showing, man. Hey, you didn't go 0-2, man. You didn't go 0-2. Think about that for a minute. You moved on. But now, we are in grand finals. Let me get out of here. So, grand finals. Malt versus Gully. Why do you need to coo, my man? Alright. Uh, Gully, whenever you're ready. There we go. No, oh, yeah. Hey, man, look. Getting third place ain't all that bad. You did really well, honestly. That's why, good shit, man. Honestly, it was really well played. And hopefully, see you in the next tournament, whenever that may be. Let's see. Okay. There we go. 
Hey, if Fatal Blows rescued bat players, why wasn't I rescued? Why wasn't I carried? See? I'm gonna try playing cleaner. That's the stuff, man. See, that's the kind of good attitude you need to have. You're gonna do hard you're gonna work better next time. Exactly. That's just how it be. Hey Kung Flu, how's it going? I didn't use it. I got knocked out of it every time, Jim. That's the funny part. I did I did use it, but I got knocked out of it every Sub single time. Alright, so Classic's gonna go with some subby wubby right now. And we're gonna see gear going right back into Sonya. So let's see how this grand finals of the MK11 International tournament for FGGVO goes. That wasn't even happen. Round one, fight. All right, there we go. Nice zoning game right now. Oof. Nice drop. Good stuff right there. Ooh, here we go. Good throw right there from Malt. Trying to play a nice fireball game. Blocking. Block the drone. Ooh, try doing the little kunai shot right there. There you go. Good stuff right there. Nice run up. Oh, good punish from Gully, though. Here we go. Alright, good freeze. Let's see some nice damage here. Oof. Very good stuff right there. Oop, didn't let the kunai stay a little longer. And that's it. Round goes to Classic. Round two. Fight. <laughs> you literally thought of ooh shit. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Good throw. Ooh, was expecting the wake up as well. Nice. Good stuff right there from Classic. Alright, time to be put into the corner. Alright, good throw attack. Big damage right there. Alright, roll the way. Had to use the meter to save himself and... Things ain't looking so good right now. Kinda hold this and that's it, get popped open. Final round. Fight. Oh my god, just imagine, right? Ooh! Damn! It's opening right there. Good meter burn. God damn, man! Alright, there you go. Classic definitely putting on that pressure. Does not want to get bopped on. Uh oh, in the corner. Getting juggled. Alright, waiting for it. Alright, throw break. Ooh, there you go. Didn't let the fatal blow go through. One more solid hit. There you go. Ice kunai. Bam. The boot enters. Jim, please. Oh snap. Hey loud, thanks for the donation. And yes, first to three. Honestly, the Scorpion Revenge movie looks pretty nice. Like it looks clean. It looks really clean. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of like a little tired of them constantly fucking redoing the first fucking tournament every goddamn time. But, I mean, it looks nice, so. It's what it is. Yo, watch it via Black Dragon methods. Ah, yes, I will as well. But yeah, I'm just kind of tired of it's like, ugh, god damn, we're doing the first tournament again. It's like, okay, I know, I get it. It's the one most people know because, you know, the movie and stuff like that. But it's like, I would at least 
I would like them to at least start animating some of the later stuff. You know what I mean? It's like, maybe MK2 tournament, or God forbid, the MK3 tournament. You know, where it wasn't really much of a tournament, it was just more like, you know, Earthrealm get fucked. Yeah, see, honestly, if they do something like MK2, but they add, like, all the other characters they eventually showed in, like, X and stuff like that, you know, it'd be something, at least, at least to, like, build them up, where it's like, oh, it's like, they don't really pay much attention to Kotal in the MK2 tournament, it's just like, oh, you know, you see Shao Kahn, and then, like, off to the side, one of his guards, you see Kotal there, it's like, you know, in pre-fucking-con status, so it's just like a little, nice little nod and stuff like that. You know, nothing too big. Just like a nice little like, ah, ah, you see, you see? That way people know. It's like, ah, he's there. But you know, stuff like that, you know? It's like, when you do references and nods, it's like, it doesn't have to be like anything too big. Just stuff like, oh, okay. It's acknowledging that, yeah, things happened, and these are characters that will be important later, kind of thing. Alright, there you go. Good throw. Very nice damage. Ooh, here we go. Right into the fatal blow. And that's the round. Ooh, my bad. I say round, but that's the match. You want an MK HBO show. See, there was that fucking online MK show that they did many years back. And it was alright from what I can remember. Like, it was okay. Nothing too amazing. It's just like, alright. That's cool. But honestly... I mean, with that whole thing where it's like, oh, they're gonna do a new MK movie. It's like with that whole MK movie that they're doing now, it's like it's another reboot of the series, but with like an MK movie, it's like, I kind of hope, you know, just tiny little hope that it's like, it takes place in like the rebooted timeline the current one, not the future rebooted timeline, whatever the fuck that was going to be. Um, so, you know, stuff like that. Like, I hope it takes place during, like, the MK9 rebooted timeline. That way, since it's like, oh, we have knowledge of future characters that will be important later, like, you know, Coltal and Scarlet and things like that. It's like, okay, in that movie, you have an opportunity to show things off like, oh, Here's Coltal, here's Scarlet in the back, you know, things like that. You have an opportunity to do things like that. There's a Cetrion reference, and there you go. See, that's all you need is just small little things to just be like, eh, wink, wink. Jim, please. Alright, there you go. Good use of the Kunai right there from Malt. Alright, recovering. Oof. Both health low. Let's see what happens. Let's take all this chip and boop, drop the drone. Round two. Fight. It was a soda machine reference or something? Jesus. You still imagine in the deep ass voice too. See, that only makes it funnier. All right, there you go. Things ain't looking good right now. Woof. Gully might just reset the bracket on classic right now, guys.
Jesus Christ, man. Like, just fucking Scorpion's deep ass voice and just saying all that ooh shit. Just like, goddamn, man. Quan Chi was wetted me to kill the Wing Kui. <laughs> like, goddamn. I can't, man. I fucking can't. Sub Zero. <laughs> oh my god, it's so fucking bad. Woof. God damn. So, yeah. Uh, Gully might be resetting the bracket. As long as Classic keeps sticking to Sub Zero over here. So, we'll see what happens. No, honestly, he's killing it with Sonya. That's why it's like... Classic is not doing well with Sub. He did well the first time, but it's like as soon as he figured him out, Gee has been doing really fucking well. Ooh, there you go. And as I speak, Classic is doing some good damage. Good meter burn. Very nice stuff right there. Ooh, gotta be careful right there. Alright, nice sweeps here and there. Need to burn fireball just in case. Oh, okay. Damn, couldn't punish it. A little too far. Nice, good opener. Ooh, if that was a trade, that would have been perfect. Waiting for it. Need to burn. Nice. And that'll be it. Alright, round goes to Gee, and he is on set point and ready to reset the bracket Does it sting? round two fight all right here we go Let's see how it happens nice jump in Ooh, getting that damage in there nice good use of meter burn all right there you go good neutral jump nice fireball Send it back up. Alright. Ooh, a little too far to actually punish. Alright, there you go. Nice throw. Get him out of here. Alright. Good block. Waiting for it. Ooh, good trade. Will he make it? No, a little too far. Still, good throw. Mm. Nice chunk of damage right there. Ooh. Here we go. Just trying to poke some out a little bit here. Good block. Nice sweep and there you go. Sweep to end. Final round. Fight. You don't have talent. Eh? Let's see. Ban the scrub. Why oh, ban him? He's winning, man. Is that what is that what you guys do? You ban people who win? Damn, man. That sucks. Alright, there you go. Good throw. One more hit will be it. And there you go. Whoop. Nice. Yeah, it's reset time. All right, let's reset these points. So let's see, what's Classic going with now that the bracket has been reset? Scorpion. Oh, okay. He was feeling a little cold earlier, but now he's hot and ready to go. And yeah, the bracket reset, so... Jade. Okay. Gully's going with Jade. Black Market Allen.
All right, so here we go, guys. He's not using Sonya, so let's see how he does. You know, you guys were complaining. Unless you're going to start complaining about Jade now, because I'd love to see that. There you go. Good starter right there, pushing him into the corner. Ooh, it's opening right there. Nice, good stuff. Keeping the pressure going into the corner. Ooh, he's not looking so good right now for Malt. Oof, damn. All right, there you go. Caught him rolling. Nice punish right there. Neutral jump and... Okay, there you go. Good throw from Malt. Getting him to the corner. Saw the uppercut coming. Nice low hits. There you go. Good opening. Waiting for the neutral jump. Good stuff. Nice throw. All right. Try teleporting. Trying to catch him with the jump kick. And boom. All right. He takes the first round. Round two. Fight. Oof. There you go. Good damage right there. Nice follow up. Good over here. Good stuff. So look at all that goddamn damage. Mm. God damn. That was beautiful. Ooh, good stuff right there. Ooh, here we go. Nice teleport. Here we go. Good follow-up. Putting the pressure in the corner. Waiting for that uppercut. Ooh, surprise, motherfucker. Nice. One round apiece. Good stuff. Final round. Fight. Here we go. Good throw. Ooh. Just a scratch. Nice teleport. Good block. There you go. Good recovery on wake up. Oh, punish that one. Very nice. Nice flame kick. Here we go. Putting the pressure in the corner. Trying to do some cross up jumps. And, ooh, the teleport into stutter with the internet. Ooh, you gotta, you gotta love the tech, man. On that fly tech. Ooh, here we go. Trying to get some damage in the corner. Put the pressure on. There you go, good block in the pop. Ooh, tried to do the cross up, didn't work out too well that time. Here we go, pop pops. And uh, that'll be it. So Gi will take the first match. Oh shit, still has some health. Nice. I spoke too soon. But I'll just keep the point there. Yeah, now, nah, man. Look at that shit. Yeah, now, nah, man. He took it. Classic took that shit back. God, can someone please, please clip that? Please, somebody fucking clip that shit. That was honestly really fucking good. I thought he was dead, but the scaling, man. Holy shit, that was, that was a hard scale. Holy shit. Alright, back to Sonya. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Hey man, you know, Sonya's his real main. He's gotta be using that. Oh, okay, good. We're using the tournament stage. I like this stage, honestly. It's super nice. Alright, good blocks right there from Classic. Ooh, good air to air. Here we go. Trying to put some pressure going on right now. Alright, waiting for the meter burn. Smart move. Alright, here we go. There's the throw. What's the setup? Ooh, went for the low. Nice. Ooh, okay, decided to fall out of that. Good stuff. 
Oof. Nice chunk of damage right there from Geet. Alright. Ooh, both hit each other at the same time. They knew what to expect here. Alright, good throw right there. Good stuff, classic. Alright, time to open them up. Ooh, tried going for a low. There you go, good opener. Nice teleport. Waiting for him to fall out. And there you go. Fatal blow to take the round? Yep. There you go. That one actually was taking the round. Alright, there we go. Good stuff. Get opened up. And, oh, yeah, that. That's a nice chunky damage right there. Nice flame kick. Ooh, block this. Wait for the meter burn. Mm hmm. Saw it coming. Nice teleport. Ooh. Here we go. Throw right into the corner. It's gonna happen. Ooh, did a little hop right there. Trying to say anything happens. Waiting for anything. Alright, good lows. Just waiting for stuff. Ooh, mistimed his uppercut. Okay, good. Broke away from that. Wanting to deal with that bullshit. Nice neutral jump. I'm waiting for stuff. Alright, good patience right there. Got him the throat. Alright, what's the answer? And the fatal blonde. Wake up. Oof. Pop. And boom. Still alive though. All right, waiting for it, and there it is. <laughs> that was beat ass and nuts. Final round, fight. All right, waiting for it. Okay, there you go. Good throw from Classic. Nice teleport. There you go, has me damage. Ooh, the ninja drop on the flame kick. Here we go. Okay, broke off. Didn't want to have to deal with that bullshit. Okay, waiting for it. Ooh, here we go, right into the corner. Good juggle combo. It's gonna happen now. Ooh, there you go. There's the throw. It's gonna happen. Oh, and that's it. There you go. Yeah, basically. Because, like, if the fatal is glowing, it's like, okay, you know they might do it. Especially if they've done it before, it's like, uh, you know, you might want to not try doing some, like, fake-ass Oki on them, but, you know. Yeah, you can stuff it. You can stuff fatal blows. We've seen fatal blows getting stuffed a lot in this tournament. Like example, if you go back to any of my matches, Sweet. you'll see all my fatal blows get stuck. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. All right, so he's gonna go scorpion again. Special forces. So, what do you guys think? Will he go to Shao Kahn if he loses one more time, or will he stick scorpion all the way through? What do you guys think? I think he might use some rings, not sure though. No, no, I'm talking about classic. I'm talking about if classic will switch up, Chubbs. But there we go. There you go, run in, good stuff. Alright, classic's doing pretty good right now. He's got a little bit of life lead. Waiting for it. Ooh. Got up a little too early from that. Waiting for it. And there you go. Dash cancel into the throw. Alright. He's got a fatal blow. But will he get a chance to use it? Not looking so hot right now for classic. Alright. There you go. Nice throw. Ooh. Yeah. That chunky damage. Uh oh, wait for it. And there's a throw. Round taken. Malt's not tier whore. 
Shocks. I mean, he was playing Shao Kahn earlier. All right, there we go. Get broken up. Try to roll away. Good stuff. Oof. Here we go. Get blasted. Not looking good right now. It's got to be a little bit of carefulness. Trying to get him over here. Ooh, got hit with the overhead. Gotta be careful there. And one more hit will be doing it. And there it is. All right. Let's see. Just pick a top tier. I'm the I'm the most prideful motherfucker, you know. Let's see, rate my food to collection at rule 34XX. <laughs> well, considering what it is, my man, uh, yeah. Let's see, I think Malt needs to let Gia hang himself and capitalize on his mistakes. I mean... Okay, he's going Garrus. Do you feel like Garrus would be a good chance to... To make some good... Ooh, excuse me. Uh, capitalization on his mistakes and punish him hard? This might work? Okay, perfect. That's perfect. Because I know Garrus does big boy damage. Off of like very basic stuff. Fight. So here we go. If Classic doesn't turn this around, he will take this. There you go, nice slam dunk. Alright, there's the throw. Alright, time to set up with Fireball game. Gotta be careful here. Ooh. There you go, put the pressure, and bop, got opened up. Wow, holy shit, haven't seen the drone in a bit. Alright, good stuff. Definitely trying to put some pressure here, no anti-air. Alright, just trying to get in with the body splash. Trying to do the fatal blow, didn't work out too well. There you go, nice opener right there. Uh oh, big punish coming in. One more hit will do it. Ooh, there you go. Fatal Blow came back just in time to help out. Oof. All right, there you go. Classic took it back. Round two, fight. Oof, there you go. Nice jump. Alright, trying to be a little careful here. Not falling for it. But being patient. There you go, nice body splash. Good opening right there. Decent damage. Ooh, damn, he let that rock a little too much. And now he's in the corner getting punched the shit out of. Let's see how things work out right now. And, okay. There you go. Managed to get out of the corner. Good stuff. Good block, here we go. Get thrown. Oof. Got opened up. Couldn't air to air him right there. Here we go. Good stuff right there, right now. Just gotta keep it careful here. Oh, caught him. Oh, damn. All right, Mog's back in the game. Here we go. Literally a fucking judo chop to the neck. Fwa! All right, so here we go, guys. Last match, final round. Whoever wins takes it 
and we are done. So let's see how this will turn out. So here we go, guys. You guys ready? Literally the final match. Winner takes all. Yeah, exactly. It went all the way down to a bracket reset. Final final match. Alright, so let's see. Here we go. All right, trying to set up some sand traps here. All right, there you go. Nice low hits at the start. Ooh, got opened up here right now from Gi. Tried to do the wake up punish, but nope, got punished instead. Kept hitting buttons, but did not get punished for them. All right, things aren't looking good right now for Malt. This round is very much snowballed pretty hard. Into Gi's side. And there you go. Here we go. Potential final round for Gi. All right, there you go. Get thrown. All right, there you go. Decided to break away. Here we go. Good grab. All right, maybe things will start snowballing into his favor and got punished. Ooh, no. Was a little too far away for you for that jump into work. There you go. Good opening. Nice. Dude, chop. There you go. Even not the health bars there. Waiting. There you go. Good punish right there from Classic. Break his back on your knee. Yeah. Like so. Good stuff. Good stuff. Making sure to catch his ass. Tries anything stupid. Uh oh. Blocking strings. Here we go. Get thrown. And. Final match. Final round. Here we go, guys. Alright. Setting a little back and forth pace right now. Uh oh. Putting the wake up pressure. Meter burn. Okay, both of them hit each other. Good stuff right there. And. Alright. Nice. Good throw right there. Dunk on him. Ooh, caught him on wake up. Oh, I didn't get the fist land. All right, here we go. Throw. What's Gia going to do? All right. Basic stuff. Didn't want to commit too much. All right. Got throw. Bam. Here we go. Thought some rings. All right. Caught him pressing button from school screen. Do chop. Ooh. There you go, broke away. Gotta be careful here. Health is low. Both of them. Oh, caught him! That's it. Nope. That's it. Here we go. And your FGG Vo MK11 Grand Champion is Classic Malt with Garrus. And he's gonna finish us off in style, everybody. Oof. Ooh! Alright. I hope everybody had a fun time in the tournament. I know I did. That was that was a clean ass way to finish the tournament. Hope you guys had fun. Hope everybody enjoyed themselves. And hopefully I get to do another one of these in the near future. And I hope to see you guys there once again. So until then, take care, everybody. Have a good night. And uh, be sure to stay safe and all that good stuff with the corona and everything. So no problem. Have a good one, guys. Later.